Happy Friday, everybody. Welcome back. Hope you guys can hear me okay. I've got the headset in today. So, uh, yeah, we're here today for a 30-minute spin. It's just myself today. Franco's still on vacation because he has, like, 100 weeks because he's been here for 100 years. So, yeah, so it's just me. Um, so today we're going to be doing a little bit of a mix of everything. Um, definitely some hills. Uh, got to keep uh, Franco's spirit with us. Um, <laughs> uh, working on some spin ups and definitely some resistance here as well. Um, so, first off, let's go ahead, get on your elliptical, get on your bike. Before you do that, though, make sure you do have enough water. You've got a towel to dry you off um, and maybe a fan or something blowing on you because it is, you're going to get a little bit warm. So, um, And then as well, too, if you can't hear the music, always feel free to throw your own music on. Um, I keep saying that we are limited in the music that we are playing. So uh, if you have something more motivating for you or more upbeat that you like better, by all means, throw that on. All right, so we're going to go ahead here. We're going to start our warm-up. So usually, like we do, we'll do a couple strong warm-up just to get ready for, for the class. So I'm just going to get going here. Just a light spin, a nice flat road underneath our feet. Oh, of course, my bike's not turning on. This is great. <laughs> All good. There we go. Hope you guys are having a great week. It feels like a heck of a long week for a short week. So, hey, Lori. Um, oh, short weeks always do. They always feel long to me. Just because you got to catch up everything in four days instead of your normal five. Oh. And then covering vacations, always fun. All good, though. So, I'll also be doing... 10 minute arms at two o'clock with the resistance bands. I think I'm going to take it outside. It looks pretty nice though. Um, dogs will probably be out with us, so it'll be good. As long as they're good and quiet. <laughs> Last week, I'm not sure if you guys saw it, but Bert came across when I put the resistance bands down when we were doing our stretch. He came across, he grabbed the resistance bands right in front of the camera. A little sneak, that one. Whew. All right, keep going here, guys. Should feel a bit of road underneath you now. Just warming up here. So if you're on your elliptical, definitely utilize that resistance. Uh, if we come out of the saddle, crank that resistance as high as you can, just to kind of get that climb. All right, keep going. All right, let's go. Nice flat road here, guys. Whew. Let's add a little bit more resistance on. Try to keep that cadence. I'm at about an 86. Resistance is about a 44, 45. So definitely enough that can come out of the saddle, no hands. Feel supported underneath. If you ever find that you are bouncing in the saddle, add the resistance and then it'll help ground you. Keep breathing. Another couple minutes here, then we're going to get into our first climb. A little bit more resistance, add it on. Hopefully you guys have some good weekends, or good weekend plans um, lined up. We're going out for dinner to Radius tonight. Tomorrow we're making a nice brisket, watching some UFC. And I think not a lot for Sunday because I think it's supposed to be raining. So a lot of entertaining the puppies. All 
right, keep going here, guys. Now I've got all non-copyright music on right now, and it's playing on a shuffle. So if something does come on, I'm gonna have to hop off the saddle real quick and change it. <laughs> all right, keep going here. All right. Let's add that resistance on here. I'm gonna bring myself up to a 50. Cadence 60 to 70. We're going into our first climb here. Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Feeling warm already. Whew. All right. Not sure what hill we're going to be going up today. Franco's more versed in all the hills in the area. That's his jam. <laughs> Let's say, uh, Let's say we'll go up Centennial Parkway today. I have to go up to Highland Packers later on, so might as well make the trip now. <laughs> Push and pull, guys. Nice flat back. Hands on the corner of the handlebars. Booty on that wide part of the saddle with your knees tracking forward. Full 360 degree paddle strokes. Fifteen seconds, we're gonna take it out of the saddle. Lori add that resistance. Five seconds. Three, two, one, add resistance, bring it up. Should be a nice jog here. Still a 60 to 70 on your cadence. I'm at a 53 for resistance. Now, bend over here. Bring your booty just about an inch above the saddle. Holding the handlebars on the third or the top position. Really focusing on pushing and pulling. You're gonna really feel it in your hamstrings. 20 seconds. We're gonna go back in that saddle. Five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Drop some resistance. Still in a climb here. Just more moderate. Forty-five seconds. We're gonna get a nice flat road here. Have a one-minute recovery. You can grab a drink, get your towel. Whew. Less than thirty. Fifteen. Keep going, guys. Last ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Drop it down. Woo! Good job. Ooh. Nice flat road here. Oh, I got my resistance at a thirty-three. Oh. Grab a quick drink. Try not to spill it on yourself like I just did. <laughs> oh, oh. So we're here for another 40 seconds. So at this point, we're coming down the hill. Then we're gonna go back up. 
I forgot to grab something for the dogs, so we got to go back to Highland and get the food. Story of my life. Always forgetting something for the dogs. <laughs> Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Add it on. Go a few more points higher if you can. I'm at a 56. Still try to maintain that 60 to 70. If you're not able to, do what's comfortable for you. Keep going, guys. Push and pull. Feeling warm. So next week, Frank goes back. He will do his regular weights class at lunch next Friday. And then the Friday following, we'll be tag teaming for spin. Back to normal. Unfortunately, it's sad because summer's almost almost over here. We didn't really get that great of a summer. It was either way too hot or raining, which wasn't great. Hopefully, you were able to get away for the summer, go to a cottage, camping, Airbnb like we did. It was great. Keep going here, guys. Two and a half more minutes. Add a little bit more resistance if you can. I'm at a 60. Naturally, your cadence is going to drop back when you add that resistance. Try to push through. Now I'm at a 55 with 60. I'm okay with that. Really working those quads. Pulling up with those hamstrings, pushing down with those calves. Take a little bit off here. Knock off two. Keep going, guys. A minute left here. Add that resistance back on. I'm at a 63. Cadence 56. Woo. Really pushing here. The rec center is opening up, which is fantastic. Unfortunately, the beach road, or sorry, yeah, the uh, beach road gym won't be opening up anytime soon. Hopefully in a couple of months. It'd be nice to get back doing live classes, using the equipment. 13 seconds. Then we're gonna go to a flat road. Have one minute rest. Three, two, one. Drop it down. Took you for about five seconds longer. Whew. Good job, guys. Whew. All right, let's write it out here. All right, we're just over the 15 minute mark. 
So now we're going to go into some spin ups, working on flushing those that lactic acid out of our muscles here. Whew. Ten seconds, we're going to pick it up for twenty, drop it down for ten, pick it up for twenty. Three, two, one, let's go. Fast legs. If you are bouncing in your seat, add a little bit of resistance. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Drop it down. Ten seconds here. Woo. Rest it up. Three, two, one. Pick it up. Let's go. Twenty seconds. Ten left. Four, three, two, one. Drop it down. And do that two more times. And then we'll get a three minute recovery. Three, two, one. Let's go. Keep going, guys. Push through. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Drop it down. Woo! Oh. Three, two, one. Let's go. Last one here, guys. One, Woo. drop it down, flower that resistance. Good job. Three minute recovery. Woo. Oh. Get a towel, grab a drink. Oh. Oh, feels great. All right, she's still riding it out here. Nice flat road. Whew. Whew. All right, guys, keep going. We are in an active recovery. We're going to add on 10 points of resistance, bring it out of the saddle, so you should be at a 40 to a 50. We're going to be here for 30 seconds. Let's go. Just a nice jog out of the saddle. Nothing too intense. Still a good recovery here. Whew. Try to breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth, getting your muscles and that off the blood, the oxygen quicker. Keep going, guys. Bring it down. Halfway through our recovery here. If you want to take it out of the saddle again, join me in three, two, and one. Let's go. Nice jog. Nothing too quick here. Make sure your back is nice and straight, nice and flat. Don't want to be up too high. Just nice, nicely hinged at the hip. Saddle, three, two, one. Whew, good job, guys. Whew. 
spreading it out here for another 20 seconds. Then we're gonna work on one leg resistance. So focusing, pushing and pulling with that one leg. Flurry on your elliptical. Add the resistance and focus on keeping your core flat or core straight, not bouncing up and down. Just keep it nice and flat, focusing on those quads. Gonna give it another 20 seconds here, guys. And we're gonna go into the left leg first, adding that resistance on as heavy as you can. 12 seconds. This will be the last set for today before we get in our warm up. Three, two, one, heavy as you can, pushing and pulling with that left leg only. Whew. She tough. Push and pull, guys. Try not to exert that other leg. Take it out of the pedal. Unclip it. Just kind of let it be there. Three, two, one. Drop the resistance. Flat road. Woo, ride it out. Twelve seconds, we're gonna go to the other side. In three, two, one, crank it up. Push and pull, guys. Woo! Everybody has a dominant leg, so it's gonna feel naturally a little bit easier on your dominant leg. Woo! Maybe add a little bit more resistance to give yourself that extra challenge. Oh, losing my ears. Keep going. In three, two, and one. Drop it down, guys. Good job. Flat road. Next, we're going to add resistance and use both legs. We're going to do that for another minute. And then we'll flat road it for two. And we'll come off and stretch. Thanks for joining me today. Hope you guys had as good, as, good of a workout as I did here. I'm drenched. <laughs> Grab a quick drink of water. We've got 20 seconds. So again, add the resistance on as heavy as you can. Three, two, and one. Let's go, guys. Keep going. Here for one minute. Push and pull. seconds. We're going to hit that nice flat road and then start our stretches. 15. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, good timing with the song. Look at that. Ooh, all right, guys. Good job. Oh, flat road here. All right. Ride it out. Good job today. Whew. Let's roll our shoulders back. It's easy to clench forward unintentionally when you're 
holding on those handlebars. That's why it's nice to always have this loose hands and bent elbows. Let's go forward. All right, let's do this. Go back, up, forward, and down. Back, up, forward, and down. Good job. Bring your arm across. Ooh, sweaty. Okay. Gonna switch to the other side in three, two, and one. All right, guys, slow your legs down. Whew. Gonna do a quick stretch here. Standing up in the saddle or lower your elliptical. If you can, put your heels down, bending slightly forward. Feeling that stretch in the back of your calves. Bring it down. Feel that stretch go all the way up your hamstrings. Switch sides. Woo. We're gonna come out of the saddle here. So unclip if you're clipped in, uncage if you're caged. Whew. All right, bringing it around. So grabbing onto the handle of your elliptical, your bike, your treadmill, bring your leg in front like a figure four, sit into it. You're gonna feel that hip flexor open up. Definitely recommend doing these stretches if you are sitting in a desk all day. Our hip flexors, our muscles tend to shrink up when we're not using them here. So if you're sitting for eight hours at a time, it, uh, your hips will thank you. <laughs> Switch sides. Bring your other leg across over your knee. Squat it down. Only go as low as you're comfortable with. Whew. All right. Here we're going to grab our ankles, bring it back. Touching our heel to our butt. Feel that stretch in your quad. You want to get a little bit deeper. Squeeze your glute. You'll feel that hip flexor open up as well. <sighs> I think this is one of my favorite ones. Switch sides, guys. Keep holding that bike for support. Squeeze that glute. Woo! It's working. <laughs> Again, thanks guys so much for joining me today. Great workout. I am drenched. Um, Frank will be back next Friday, and then both of us will be tag teaming again the following Friday. But I'll see you guys at 2 o'clock for 10-minute arms with the boys outside. If not, have a great weekend. Bye.